It's no coincidence that Microsoft is shipping its new Surface Studio all-in-one as the Windows 10 Creators update drops. This is a content creator's workstation, and it's a distinct pleasure to use. Make no mistake about it, with prices starting at $3,000, this is a professional tool. Our review model cost $4,200 and included a Core i7, discrete NVIDIA GPU, plus a two terabyte hard drive and 128 gigabyte SSD for storage and speed. Any conversation about the Surface Studio begins with a display. The stunning 28 inch 4.5K screen dominates your vision. And the screen is large enough so that you can snap four windows to each corner. Another key selling point is the display's ability to glide downwards to just above your desk. But just make sure you're not resting your coffee cup in front of it when you do. It's an easel mode where the studio really shines. Inking directly onto the screen, as opposed to using a separate Wacom tablet, is really a fantastic experience. It's here too that the associated surface dial really comes into its own. The Bluetooth powered dial can rest either on the screen or on your desktop. In Windows, a series of basic options can be dialed up with a twist, then selected with a tap. In supported inking applications, the dial allows you to quickly adjust color, line widths, and more, letting you make quick adjustments as you work. It does tend to slip a bit though, and sometimes it's easier to just adjust the color with your pen. As for the mouse and keyboard, well, both are satisfactory, if a bit spartan. The keyboard keys are even slightly smaller than the Surface Book, but I learned to live with it. Now let's talk a little bit about where the studio could improve. For one thing, Microsoft chose the iMac-like approach of placing all of the expansion ports on the back, making them tough to reach. It makes you pine for the Surface Pro 4. The studio's glossy screen also tends to reflect quite a bit of light. Third, building in a mobile processor and GPU is par for the course in all-in-ones. But since they're housed in the base, I'd be interested to see Microsoft try a small form factor alternative with a bit more horsepower. Why? Because at over $3,000, the studio is significantly more expensive than competing all-in-ones, even gaming PCs. The Surface Studio is a marvelous, trail-breaking product, but I think other PC makers could offer something similar for a lower price. What it comes down to though, is that the Surface Studio is a creator's machine, and Microsoft thinks that sets it apart. And you know what? They're right. <laughs>